Welcome back, Fluffy Foodies, to Fluffy's Food Reviews. And today, with your host, Fluffy, we're going to get into some deep dive into a new sandwich. A new sandwich, a new burger, a new craft burger that is at Wendy's. And this burger has sauce on it. Not ketchup, not mustard, not barbecue sauce, not even Wendy's special sauce, not mayo. This sandwich, this sandwich has marinara sauce. But here's the catch. Here's the catch. Nice and warm, smells delicious. It's a special type of bun. A never be seen before bun. This bun is a garlic knot bun. And on top of that, there's one patty on this, but there's another, another patty-like substance inside this. A smelly, tasty garlic. It is literally a patty size mozzarella fried. Come on, folks. It's fried. That's the best part. So we got the top bun, which is that amazing garlic knot. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It's literally a pull apart. And then we're coming in with a deep dive of that oozing mozzarella. Look at that right there. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, it's oozing. Look at that. That monster was oozing. So we're gonna take that, we're gonna take that mozzarella patty and we're trying to split it with a nice slice of American cheese. And after you got that amazing Wendy's patty, never frozen with another garlic knot bottom bun. This bottom bun is kind of weird because literally it is a pull apart. It is a pull apart. You see, this is a pull apart garlic knot, but it's flat. It's not puffy like the top. So with that big ooze of American cheese, I want to say it's American cheese. It's got to be. Then you got the Wendy's bun, and then you literally got a fried mozzarella patty with the nice marinara sauce laying on top of it. Ooh, it should be nice and tasty. Let's get right in here. We're going to get right into this first bite, and I'm going to let you know my thoughts. But before we do, this sandwich at my Wendy's was $7.86. Ooh, so it wasn't too high. It is less than a Baconator, because if I'm not mistaken, a Baconator is more a little just over $8. So it's in a fair range, especially with what you get. You technically get two patties, in a sense, with the mozzarella stick. But... This has got a hefty calories on this. There's 780 calories on this one sandwich in here. 780 calories. For some people, that might be just a third of what your calorie intake is for a day. Just a third. Imagine that. But we're gonna get in here, we're gonna kick that first little bite. I'm trying to find a good spot to be able to get a little bit of everything. Hold the foam. Hold the foam. Is this, could this be 2022's best burger? Maybe even Wendy's best burger in a long time. That mozzarella, yes, it's not that crispy as I would like it, but that mozzarella packed a punch on top of that burger. Like I'm telling you, it packed a punch. Woo! All right. Got the amazing burger flavor from Wendy's. 
a strong mozzarella flavor. That sauce is not compared to like the Burger King Italian one that we tried where I said it was pretty tomatoey. This is like a good marinara sauce. Like something you would you would buy or go to a restaurant, a sit down and dip your mozzarella sticks in. It's a very good mozzarella. Um, I mean, it's very good marinara sauce. That mozzarella is not like a cheap mozzarella. That's got good punch. And paired with that burger, it's so good. But that garlic knot bun reminds me of like having garlic bread with spaghetti and meatballs. It, you just get that no chalance, happy feeling inside. So with everything that I have said, all right, guys, you ready for this? With everything I've said, this burger, I am giving it a solid 8.7. This could be like, this is literally the best burger I've had all year out of all the restaurants. And I'm sure this burger will even beat the new quarter pounder from McDonald's because I haven't got to that one yet. But this burger, hands down, is slap your mama in the face good. Like literally, slap your mama in the face, get yourself this burger because it's absolutely amazing. You need this burger in your life. Not mine. Oh, no. Yes, I do. But in your life. Definitely go to your Wendy's. Try this amazing burger out. You know my score. Let me know down in the comments below if you agree with my score. Let me know if you have tried this burger. And let me know if you want to try this burger. Let me know down in the comments your thoughts of this video. As always, guys, go check out when I did try Burger King's version. Go, go click that video right there when I tried Burger King's version and then go over here and subscribe to this channel so you can be updated on all the latest food videos, whether it's in store, in a restaurant, or in your fast food drive through I will be there to review it for all of you. All right, guys, hope you all have a blessed day. Eat up!